From the Earth's depths to a master's hands, every diamond tells a story, one forged over millions of years by immense heat and pressure. In this journey, each facet, angle, and polished surface transforms a rough stone into a radiant gem, unlocking its hidden brilliance. Today, we explore the intricate art of diamond cutting, where science and the craftsman's intuition come together to reveal nature's finest sparkle. Welcome to the History of Simple Things, where we delve into the fascinating history behind the little things that shape our world. When a diamond first arrives at a cutting workshop, is nothing like the gem we picture adorning jewelry. In its raw state, it's rugged, irregular, and filled with imperfections and visible inclusions. But inside, there's potential, a spark that only the trained eye and skilled hand of a master cutter can unlock. Like a sculptor studies a block of marble, the diamond cutter examines the rough stone, visualizing the masterpiece that lies within it and determining how best to approach the transformation. With every cut, there is both risk and reward. The wrong choice can shatter the stone or reduce its value, but the right one can unlock a beauty that captivates the world. Each diamond's transformation begins with evaluation and planning, a vital first step that sets the course for every step to follow. Using advanced 3D mapping technology, Gemologists scan the stone, analyzing every angle, every internal line, and every inclusion. No two diamonds are alike. Each one has a unique map within its structure. This invisible blueprint guides the cutter in deciding the best way to shape the stone and maximize its inherent beauty and market value. It's a balancing act that requires a delicate mix of science and intuition. Sometimes, Sacrifices in carat weight must be made to avoid major inclusions and flaws, while in other cases, strategic adjustments can enhance the diamond's overall clarity and brightness. In this way, the process of cutting becomes a collaborative dance between nature's design and human artistry. Once the diamond's map is understood, it's time to divide the rough stone into the cleaving and sawing stages. Cleaving was once a delicate procedure done by striking the diamond with a sharp blade, requiring both accuracy and a steady hand. Today, however, technology has transformed this process. High-powered lasers have replaced the old methods, allowing cutters to slice through even the hardest diamonds with incredible precision. These lasers emit concentrated beams of light that penetrate the diamond's internal structure along pre-planned paths, creating clean, accurate cuts by carefully following the diamond's natural grain, the cutter avoids potential cracking or shattering, which could ruin the stone. It's a slow, painstaking procedure, but every detail counts. This is only the beginning of the diamond's journey to brilliance. Once divided, the diamond is ready for shaping. Known as bruting, this process is where the rough stone takes on its first true form. The diamond is placed on a lathe and spun, with its edges ground down by another diamond. Only a diamond can cut another diamond as it's the hardest natural material on Earth, ranking 10 on the Mohs scale of hardness. Here, brute force meets precision as the cutter carefully rounds out the stone's edges, creating a symmetrical base shape. This initial shaping is crucial because it establishes the foundation for all subsequent facets. The cutter's goal is to ensure that every angle aligns in a way that will maximize the diamond's future brilliance, allowing light to travel and reflect in ways that amplify the gem's natural sparkle. Next comes faceting, the step that brings the diamond to life by enhancing its capacity for reflection and refraction. Faceting begins with a process called blocking, where the cutter carves out the main facets that define the diamond's shape. In a round, brilliant cut, for example, this initial phase creates eight pavilion facets, eight crown facets, and the large table facet at the top of the stone. These primary facets establish the diamond's basic geometry, but it's the next phase, called brillianting, that adds the finishing touches. Brillianting involves adding smaller facets to increase the diamond's reflectivity. Each facet is cut at a precise angle, so when light enters the stone, 
it is reflected in a controlled dance across its surface and then exits in a dazzling display of brilliance. The final cut for a round, brilliant diamond results in 57 or 58 facets, each working in harmony to produce a dazzling array of sparkles. A single misaligned facet can dull the diamond's overall radiance, underscoring the necessity for absolute precision and mastery. Polishing is the final stage, where the diamond surfaces are refined to create the flawless finish we associate with polished gems. This process smooths out any minor imperfections, bringing each facet to a radiant shine. Using a wheel embedded with diamond powder, a material as hard as the diamond itself, the cutter polishes every angle, gradually achieving a mirror-like finish that allows the gem to capture light in its purest form. Polishing requires a delicate touch and meticulous attention to detail, as even a slight error could diminish the diamond's ability to reflect light. Every surface is smoothed until the diamond's brilliance is fully realized, creating the vibrant luster we recognize as the mark of a well-cut stone. After polishing, the diamond undergoes a final inspection, during which expert eyes examine every facet, angle, and surface under magnification. This final check ensures the diamond meets industry standards of symmetry, clarity, and polish, which significantly affect its value. The smallest flaw could detract from its overall beauty, making this inspection crucial. Once it passes, the diamond is ready to be graded based on its cut, which encompasses three key criteria, brilliance, fire, and scintillation. Brilliance refers to the white light reflecting within the stone, fire to the rainbow-like dispersion of colors that light produces, and scintillation to the diamond's sparkling effect when moved. Together, these qualities form the essence of a diamond's allure and determine its grade. A well-cut diamond can amplify its natural qualities, masking minor inclusions and color variances, while a poorly cut diamond, even if flawless, will lack the captivating luster that makes it desirable. From an unrefined crystal to a radiant gem, a diamond's journey is one of patience, skill, and artistry. Each step, evaluation, cleaving, brooding, faceting, and polishing, tells the story of craftspeople who have dedicated their lives to revealing the hidden beauty within each stone. It's a journey that begins in the dark depths of the earth and ends as a testament to human achievement. In every facet lies a tribute to the cutter's skill, capturing and magnifying the diamond's natural radiance. This is the art and science of diamond cutting, where the world's most cherished stones are born, a legacy of brilliance preserved for generations. Thank you for watching. If you have suggestions for our next video, feel free to share them in the comments below. We'll be sure to give you an acknowledgement for your contribution. Thank you for joining us on this journey through the history of simple things. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and stay tuned for more stories woven through the smallest details.